The first step in form tool installation is to set the lateral adjusting screw in position, followed by the tool post bolts and the tool holder. Due to a clearance problem with the third position tool arm, it is necessary to install the tool post bolts and holder together. Care should be taken that the slide contains no burrs or chips that may interfere with the bearing of the tool holder to the slide. The 3092-9-4 plate should be placed atop the holder and secured in place with the tool post nuts. The tool may now be inserted into the dovetail ways of the holder and secured lightly in place with two cap screws on the side of the holder. The cap screws should only be snugged up at this time. The tool should be positioned such that there will be room for the tool setting gauge to be placed beneath the tool. The tool should now be adjusted downward until the tool contacts the tool setting gauge and the gauge slips out easily. The two cap screws should be tightened as well as the 840-11 nut on the set screw. Recheck the setting to verify that the tool has not moved during tightening of the screw. The tool should now be adjusted laterally through the use of the lateral adjusting screw until the second position form is properly positioned.
Pushing the tool forward against a workpiece with the cam lever handle will generally verify alignment. We should then make the appropriate turnbuckle adjustments and run a workpiece. When the blank is ten thousandths of an inch below the finished diameter, it is time to set the positive stop. Advance the machine to the highest point of the form cam and turn the position stop screw until it contacts the stop screw in the revolving head. Adjust the stop screw until the workpiece diameter is correct.